Holy shit. Look, look at that. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like Arlequin is reaching for my fucking soul. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm ready to see Father in action. I'm absolutely ready to see Father in action. Also, like, yeah, of course, um, the House of Hearth crew is there as well. Alright, here we go. 12 seconds. Let's fucking go. Four, three, two, one. Come to me, Father. Oh. It has been millennia since the fall of Remuria, and its history has long faded into the mists of mythology and superstition. No, <laughs> Legends tell Ooh. of how before the birth of the Court of Fontaine, there was an New empire area? known as Remuria. Remurians Remuria. believed that King Remus would bring eternal prosperity to the islands of the High Sea. However, the God King's seers prophesied discord. The greatest empire will face the most utter destruction. This looks like a new area. And this is Fortuna. Thus did the God King derive the primordial plan from the cycle of the seven days and winds blowing over sea and land, <laughs> and composed. A I feel like Alakin is like telling me a bedtime story. Like he took Linny, Lynette, he and Fremay in bed and just is just reading them this. <laughs> judgment and attain eternal paradise if they harmonized with his perfect symphony. This but is definitely a new area. Today, I've never seen a place like this in Genshin before. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 4.6 special program. Hey. Let's take a look at the trailer. Oh, immediately trailer. Okay, let's go. On oh, occasion, universe. we hold barbecue dinners at the house. They hunt for food, compete oh, the... with each other, even oh, cooperate. That's her. They Holy enjoy shit. participating in activities like that. And the feeling is mutual. After all, it's always possible certain familiar faces will be missing from the crowd the next time. These a are definitely new places. Hey, Mal for exploration. Come up. Sino. As it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed it essential to inform you all. It was a we're going back to Samaria. Plan shrouded in secrecy. We all gathered around and celebrated the revival of our Lord. That's how I gained my power. Whoa. The old man's been putting the pressure on me. Child, he hey. sent someone to tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. Oh, is that the new Stephen? fucking Participating world boss? Plan will lose a lot of members in the process. Whoa. I did not anticipate we would meet again after presenting you with the Gnosis. If you accept my proposal, Monsieur Neville. Whoa, wait, is that the whale? absolutely necessary. I will no longer carry out any special missions within Oh, yep. Ah, la Oh yeah, she is she the fucking scythe. Oh yeah, she. Oh my, that is a fucking scythe. Transfixed. Everlasting at the oh moon. Oh my god, domain expansion. <laughs> oh, she looks so good already. An order once given cannot be rescinded. What? Who? Cool. Do you have any idea what What's you're that? doing? You're hiding the very person Father has been trying to find. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else into this. If uh, Father finds out about this, everyone involved is going to be punished. A traitor. Yeah, it seems I know was chosen. Why are we going back to Samaria? He was not the only one. You'd like me to return Wait, my power? Wait, are we gonna get a Sino Part 2 quest? I'm really looking forward to this right of duels. Who is the this? The wisdom of Hermanubis would have been ours. Who's this guy? I want you to become the next king of the house. Yet you seem to have different ideas. Oh shit, what? I'm not saying I have all the answers. <gasps> what? But doing so will only oh, bring us further doing? away from being a real family. Your words paint Oh my god, yeah, oh, Weepy Boss on the Allow me to remind you, Helen. For you sure, Weepy Boss. Oh my god, she has like a fucking demon form. <laughs> I'll make sure it's drained of all impurities and returned to its cleanest form. Good things come to children who do as they're told. Oh my god, so I do okay. hope you decide to take <laughs> accurate Arlecchino. Holy shit. There are shit. many dangers ahead, and I, for one, don't intend to back down. I don't want to disobey an order from Father. Yeah, so we're why? fighting her. Why we're so, have you so backed fighting us into her. A oh my no god. Demonstration father of is fathering right Lord. now. And no sacrifice shall be in vain. Holy shit. That was a f oh my god, that was da -da -da -da. fucking awesome. Hey, Hello, Ito's here everyone. for some reason. <laughs> I'm Sarah Miller Cruz, the voice of the female traveler Lumine. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 4.6 so special fuck? She's program. She's both playable Yay, and you get to fight her. Welcome! 
<laughs> okay, so I'm pretty sure that everyone would agree that Damn, the just House like of the Hearts isn't an ordinary orphanage. But just in case you needed any convincing, we've invited their voice actors to share some information with us today. Hey everyone, my name is Erin Yvette. I'm the voice of Arlequino, the father of the House <laughs> of the Hearth. You might also she recall sounds so that weird when she's like being Harbinger friendly. The knave. <laughs> I'm so thrilled to have been invited yeah, to this special program. What the heck did Linny and the yeah. others do? Hi folks, okay. I'm Damon Mills, They said something the about Linny and Tremene hiding the person Arlequino's looking for, yes, and then they're being yeah. punished for it. And although he's not a member of the House of the Hearth, hmm. we've also brought the harbinger of laughter and cheer, the one and only. <laughs> Voice of Arataki Ito. The beatboxing king. Up, Let's it's fucking me, go. Max Middleman. Hey everybody, what's going on? Why are you here? Guys, I'm dead here, but why? Yeah. <laughs> so good. Are you excited to be here? Vibes, vibes, vibes. <laughs> vibes, for <day>. vibes. <laughs> All right. Well, without any further delay, let's start introducing the new content from version 4.6. I've heard that travelers will be experiencing new content related to the House of the Hearth in the upcoming version. Erin, why don't you give us a rundown on what sort of organization the House of the Hearth is? <laughs> Not yes, a good one. It would be my pleasure. Based on the most recent intelligence Whoa, reports, Dio the House Bale of the Hearth Moon. is a, what a fucking badass title. Operated by the, the ninth, the, f the knave, uh, sorry, the fourth of the Fudui no Harbingers. All manner of reasons, and they receive an education in a variety of disciplines. Naturally, oh at the same time. <laughs> time as it provides a home, the children also take on various responsibilities. Yeah, I think it's okay. about time we saw this the Fatui side of Arlequino. Uh, is there more news to like hear? Like in the Archon Quest, yes. she seemed very, very friendly, which is very, very uncharacteristic of a Fatui Harbinger. And the Knave, the fourth Harbinger of the Fatui, is still hiding many uns. It's about time mysteries. we saw her, like, villain aside. So how about we start diving into all the new information that we have about Arlequino? Yeah. Okay, so it is confirmed yes, Arlequino is okay, the okay. next weekly boss. I, I want to hear it straight from <laughs> So you get to find what Child, kind of Senora, Scaramouche, and oh my gosh, Arlequino. I'm feeling a lot of pressure The right holy <laughs> quadrilogy <laughs> of weekly bosses. Uh, for two weekly um, bosses. I guess during the Fontaine Archon quest, I noticed that Arlequino was really skilled at directing the conversation. Her way of speaking was incredibly refined and polite, but... She was also incredibly intimidating. <laughs> I mean, remember how Farina pretended not to recognize her and talked about having nightmares? I totally get where she was coming from. Mm. But that's just an outsider's point of view, right? <laughs> what is the knave like as a parent? I think Damon is probably the best <laughs> oh. person to answer that question. <laughs> okay, uh, take it away. <laughs> okay, you were hoping that I would be the weakest link? Yeah. Well, <laughs> she's a very strict father. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah. Strict. Um, hmm. All right, it sounds like she gives everyone an intimidating impression. Yeah, but I think Arlequino loves all of the house's children equally, and she would never treat them harshly for no reason, though... The kids hmm. feel a lot of pressure during her lessons. Oh yeah, she said something about by her stern attitude, about somebody being the next for their own good. In so an the next like leader the of the house of the hearth. So need to be more so mature, tough. And maybe our theories the were coming true were about like Linny trying you know? to take over, mm, or Linny going to become sad, the though, isn't it? It is, yeah, eventually yeah. taking yeah. over the house of hearth. Her, this if Arlequina were to retire, why are they this way? Okay, wait, wait. Are you trying to say that she treats the kids like that because she was traumatized? Ooh, okay. Yeah. Now that's very sharp of you, oh, no. but let's keep our Lakino secrets hidden for just a little bit longer. Okay, okay. Um, I do have a question, though. Why did the children call her father? Ah, well, if you're curious about Arlequino's past, then you'll have to find your answer in, in the, the game. Quest. Her story quest. Or the story quest. Okay, no, it's a story quest. I thought it would be an Arkham quest, not gonna lie. Now, I don't want to like, spoil Arkham anyone's interlude. gameplay experience by Never saying mind. too much about her quest, okay? But I do hope that travelers will be able to appreciate Arlequino's unique charm after they've experienced yeah. her entire story. After you, yeah. after you get beat the shit out. Version 4.6 will also introduce <laughs> by, by a her. new feature, the focused experience Ooh. mode. Now, if you use the uh. feature while playing Arlequino's story quest, then it will minimize the number of times that you'll be interrupted by characters or quest locations being allocated to uh, other what? quests. So hopefully this mode will help travelers have oh, a better story oh, it's experience, like, cool. you know? Nice. To prevent you that's from getting right. cocked by the and other the quests. Future, this function that's, will become that's available nice. for more and more quests. 
Besides the story quest, I'm also looking forward to hearing the Knave's voiceover lines because Aaron's kind of awesome. <laughs> we'll finally be able to hear what she thinks about the other Harbingers, too. Yes, I selfishly also think that will be cool. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so next, it's let's so take a look at our elegant I'll say it again. Yet deadly fighting style. Yes, look at her kid. <laughs> yeah. Give her to me. Staring into my eyes is ill advised. Good lord. Father is fathering. <laughs> oh my god, that's her idol? Transfixed. Holy shit. Oh my god, wait, she has those wings in her kit as well? Damn, okay. Oh yeah, and, and the fact that her fucking. Wait, she gets to just fucking float across the ground? <laughs> is that what I saw? Oh my god, that, that's such a cool looking oh, burst. Oh that was awesome! <laughs> I like how she glides. Yes, I love yes. that her yeah, weapon is a fucking elegant. scythe. Like, that was We've been a asking for that for ages. Like, and elegant but deadly. Yes. Like a, yes, like a ballerina. If anybody death. were to have a scythe, it would be Arlecchino. So effortless. I know, right? Yes. All right, well, if we're going to talk about Arlecchino's combat abilities, then we're going to have to talk about the bond of life mechanic. Uh, oh. You might have been a victim to it while you were fighting elite Fatui operatives in Did Fontaine. Did she apply to herself? Does anyone still remember what but a bond of life is? construct opponents. It applies a Yo, blood depth directives for a appropriate time. Guys, you're when too using loud. Pipe down. <laughs> charge <laughs> attack or Let's elemental to burst to opponents. <laughs> the blood depth Wait, directive. I, I you absorb it's and clear nearby blood depth directives. There's a grant of bond of life and... any healing that your character receives. So they can't regain HP until the bond of life value has been healed. Yeah. Yes. Oh, right. so Very good, it's like student. a debuff <laughs> she inflicts on herself. Has a bond of life okay. greater than or equal to a certain percentage Arlequina of enters the Masquerade of Red Death state when the value of her bond of life is equal or greater to than a certain percentage of HP. Which can't be overridden by other elemental infusions. And while she's okay, in she gets power infusions. Well, her normal attacks will consume a portion of her current bond of life to deal more damage and reduce the remaining cooldown on her elemental skill. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 know, a it's a lot, it's a lot. So you're saying that oh, she'll deal more damage I'm pretty sure these are pre-recorded. I don't think they're doing this live. <laughs> I'm pretty sure these are pre-recorded. <laughs> Put simply, yes. Whoa, whoa, I think whoa, all the lives are pre-recorded, honestly. <laughs> no, wait, I get it. Wait, so uh, Arlecchino can give herself a bond of life, right? Yeah, uh, I, I think so. I mean, otherwise yeah, she like has to chase down debuff. enemies who can put a bond of life on her. <laughs> Actually, that, that sounds kind of funny. <laughs> I'd like to see that. Uh, and that brings us to our elemental skill. Our Lakino skill doesn't just damage enemies. It also Damn, applies look at those a animations. blood debt directive to any enemy that it hits, which will damage them I love the fucking spinning with a scythe. It's so cool. And when she uses a charged attack or her elemental burst, she'll absorb nearby blood debt directives. This okay. also allows her to obtain a bond of life based on the number of directives that she absorbed. So don't worry, Max. Oh, I was very huh. concerned. <laughs> I know, I know you were. <laughs> okay, hold on. She can't regain HP until her bond of life is removed, right? So how does she stay in the fight? Well, after dishing out damage, Arlecchino's elemental burst will reset the cooldown of her elemental skill and oh. heal her based on her attack and her current bond. Okay. Uh, okay. She seems like, Thanks yeah, I think Marchose Hunter is going to be good on her. in combat, she gains bonus sure. pyro damage, but also cannot be affected by any healing effects other than the healing provided by her burst. Oh, so I, that seems like she's as ruthless to herself yeah, as she yeah. is to her mm. enemies. Like she needs therapy. Probably. <laughs> she needs therapy. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> she's kind of a savage. I mean, <laughs> um, right. So I feel like all the Futui char Harbingers are just messed up in some way. She uses her charged attack, mm. right? Ooh, that looks perfect for scaring what? her enemies. Yes. Yeah, and for putting some that's, serious pressure on That's her charge on attack? Her. You can just try to just fly across the water. That's sick. And also her uh -huh. scythe. Again, oh, I gotta about mention. time to introduce the event wishes in version 4.6. Get ready. Oh, yeah, batters. Yeah. Okay, let's so see them. All right. During the first phase of version 4.6, yep. okay, Linny, we run. We call that. Linny will both enjoy a drop rate. Boost. Of course, of the course, it's gotta be the father and the. Oh, yeah, and her fucking scythe. Will also become available. Yeah. Also, oh. the Wanderer and Baiju will return in the second oh, wander. phase. Oh, okay. Wanderer, okay. So be sure to keep and an Baiju. eye on Wait, Baiju. Yay! Oh my gosh, that's so did she amazing. Just, <laughs> didn't Baiju okay, just have so a rerun with Farina? Aaron and Damon 
Do you have any other news you'd like to share? So early? Actually, I do. Damn, Let's okay. Let's discuss the new I'm weekly glad boss. Back. Oh, yeah. 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 Right. But you we fight Arlequino when you pull for Arlequino. Different faces to her family members and to outsiders, but in special circumstances. Holy shit, she looks she fucking insane. Other side. <laughs> That's right. Yes, he's like, Are Arlequina's you ready play style to see turns, a new name? Like, pull yes. out into size. I am ready. So ready. Which seems kind of awesome, not gonna lie. Oh, is this a weekly boss theme? <laughs> oh, yeah, this is like not like um, composed by Yu Peng Chang. So I wonder how it's gonna sound. Dude, her fucking move set. Holy shit! Domain expansion. Devil Ar Arlequino. Good lord. Can we get that style for Arlequino, like in the open world? Oh shit, traveler. Watch out! <laughs> Whoa, whoa, okay. Hello, something all to death. Oh god, what the fuck? Holy sh! Wow, not even Linny and Fremenet have seen this side of her before. Mm. So the knave is accepting challengers now? Jeez, mm -hmm. oh yeah, why can't She's we have so like elegant, this outfit of hers? I would gladly chill out like 10 bucks yes. for, for just a simple color pilot more change. Badass with twice. The badassitude. <laughs> hey, it's not so simple to see the knave's other side. She'll appear normally at first. Oh god, Linny. <laughs> giving you an ordinary training lesson, waiting to give it a watch out. Attacks. Oh my god, yeah, she's fucking phasing. She'll dodge all of our attacks like a phantom if we're out of her immediate range. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it feels like she's implying that we're. It, this all feels like in fighting Wesker in Resident Evil 5. I mean, you guys know what her personality's like. She doesn't want her children <laughs> crying or running away from conflict. Instead, she hopes that yeah, they'll be able to. She's like, no, you need to fight me at close range. if their opponent is their own father. The outside world will not show her children mercy, so oh, neither she can, can she afford bond to be too of life as well. Damn. If and of course, a party consists the of Traveler, Lenny, and Fremenet. If applies to you, all her attacks against you will be enhanced. But hey, if you manage she just to fucking annihilated the bond of life, the knave will reward you for repaying this blood debt, and your charged attacks against her will be enhanced. Oh. Uh, don't the bone wings on her back look like spiders? <laughs> yes, I would yes, say more like, <laughs> like. Oh my gosh, it's like she has like dragon control wings, but of her sure. While she watches them Actually, yeah, you could do kind of look like spider legs. <laughs> it's kind of creepy being the hunted one for once. <laughs> oh my god. So, okay, okay, okay. I think we she should seems, stop the introduction Arlequina here. Arlequina seems insane. Let's leave Holy some space shit. for everyone to experience the challenge for themselves. Wait, so I know that many travelers will be wondering about this. Yeah, she's a fucking Frostborn angel of death or something. Story quest. <laughs> Normally, players would have to progress the story to a certain point in order to participate in oh, the right, challenge. Oh, right, but you can just but say fuck that. Have a quick challenge feature for yeah, the quick challenge feature. So you can just yeah. fight her without needing to do her story quest. As long as travelers are adventure rank 40 or higher, they'll be able to challenge her directly by going to the adventurer handbook, I think going to the I'll play Arlequina's quest day one and then do her weekly boss when it comes up in the story. I don't think I'll do it on just to get her materials. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> that is really valuable information to have. <laughs> and it also looks like it's my turn to deliver some news. Two new artifact sets will become oh, available you, in version 4.6. Fragment oh shit. Of harmonic whimsy oh, you know what that means, rubbery. folks. More Travelers artifact farming. Who are interested in them should stay tuned for One more of them's got to be like an cool. Arlequino set or something, right? Oh, you're finished. Okay, wait. How come your update was so <laughs> short? It wasn't enough for me. Yeah, give us more. <laughs> okay, okay. I actually do have other news to share. Ooh. Yes, yes, yes. I want to see the stats of the artifacts, but we get, I guess we got to wait. Sumeru City will be experiencing an unsolved mystery. Ooh. And for some reason, I was, I was right. mixed up in it. Hey, how did it you is know a about that? Sino Part 2 quest. Right there. Oh, shit. Oh, oh right. 
<laughs> Oops. <laughs> well, Sino wanted to investigate so, so personally now, because someone involved. Sino has joined the club of Yoimiya of non archons having a mm. second story quest. So there's some serious shenanigans going That's on. That's right. Is this a case where we get to use violence <laughs> if the situation gets too complicated? Violence. These are all very good guesses, but I'll offer you hmm. one clue. I'm surprised at giving out like a second story quest, but not doing a Sino rerun. A Who is this? A mysterious youngster with connections to what the mystery. The will make his debut during the case. Hmm. And is that an Sino NPC? Are not just that's the most beautiful NPC I've ever food. seen, if that's the case. Hainari, Kale, Alhatham, and Kave will all come to support him when he's in a pinch. Oh shit, the Sumero so, yeah, boys are coming in clutch. Let's go. Case, then be sure and to Kale check out too. Sino's second story quest, Lupus Arius Act 2. Travelers can venture to Sumeru and investigate the secrets lurking underneath the sands. In due time, of course. <laughs> Sarah, the boy, totally the Sumeru delivered. boys that are all getting news. involved. <laughs> they said, yeah, Tanairi, Alhatham, Kaveh, and Sino himself, and Kale, to too. Wait, wait, Let's really? fucking wait, go. Wait, 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 what are we wait. waiting for? We've just presented too much information too quickly. C can, we, can we take a break, please, so we can digest <laughs> all of it, please? Oh, yeah, please. that was a lot of info. He can't keep getting away I with this. <laughs> right. No, no, Damon, you're right. I know. Let's check out the first redemption code before we continue introducing the new content. That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. That's what I thought. <laughs> okay, let's just take this chance to uh, just recap what we just saw. Um, okay, so in the trailer, they s Arlokino, I think, was saying, like, you're going to be taking over the hearts of the Hearth or something like that. I, I believe she was addressing this to Linny. I, I think our theories are coming true and that Linny is going to be the one to take over the House of Hearth if Arlequino ever, like, retires or dies or who knows. I don't think she'll die, but yeah, Arlequino or Linny is going to be, like, the second in command, I feel like. For sure. Also, yeah, that fucking weekly boss looks sick. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to be doing that day one just to challenge the Arlequino boss fight. I believe they're like yeah, Arlequina's fighting like uh, the, the the trio here because I, I believe in the quest, Lenny said that uh, Fremne was like hiding somebody that Arlequina was looking for. Don't know who that somebody is, but yeah, uh, they I guess Arlequina found out and they're getting hey, punished for it. Hey, welcome back everyone. So hey. we we'll come back to this already later. told you the story of Arlequino and the House of the Heart. New area, so, why don't we capital. Holy the story shit! Of Ramuria, which you saw in the beginning of the program. I would like this very much, please. <laughs> yes, you did such a yes, good job. Yes. Encore, <laughs> encore. <laughs> a new area of Fontaine will open in version 4.6. This looks fucking Travelers beautiful, I tell you. The village of I mean, the Petricorn. underworld is... <laughs> the underwater world Though, is very beautiful, but... Be look look at these freaking statues. Island. Well, yeah... Uh, look at this, like, cozy is, little this town. This where I'm supposed to really confidently say, Totally! Right. It is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that you've mentioned it, there's, there's a bell tower too. more to this village than meets the eye, right? Yeah, I, I feel like I'm playing Kingdom Hearts again. Here. <laughs> this is where the kingdom of Remuria's remains lay at rest. So, how big was such a glorious and prosperous Whoa, what nation? What the fuck? Really? Mm. I thought, well, what is that? that? I mean, is that the whale? Looks, uh, whole lot no way. Why is that cat falling out? That's a neat trick. What? <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> this is where we'll meet. A talking cat with its guidance. Another talking to cat, okay. The civilization that vanished thousands of years ah, ago. Ah, yes, the first talking cat we met oh was black, God. and now this oh, one's white. Amazing. Anything for a talking cat. <laughs> Holy mother, As that's Aaron a big ass cat. At the beginning of the program, King Remus Holy Sir Pancelon, you changed. One with wondrous power that grants the wishes of the human souls dwelling within. Yes, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm, I, I actually, I don't You're get it. You're so not yeah. getting it. That's okay. I will explain it in a few words. Look at this so fucking coral reef. You'll just have to learn about the symphony by going on an that adventure looks with beautiful. this little cat. I'll avoid spoiling the adventure itself, but you'll arrive at the Remoria <laughs> ruins with the cat. Yeah, what is this? The kingdom's this can't be the whale, the right? It's gotta be something else. It's way too you'll small to be the whale. In the deep seas. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. So you'll be able to obtain powers relating to the symphony, which will help you explore the uh, lost of course, realm new puzzle of mechanics. You'll be able to pause the melody within the realm of this ancient civilization. Yeah, this place. You can I, also I, I might be excited to explore this place, honestly. So oh, these cool. powers will let you yeah, this place interact super with interesting. objects in the ruins. You know, that might be useful for solving puzzles during your adventure. 
Totally. Ooh. Meanwhile, a forgotten statue sits in a recess of the faded castle, silently proclaiming the immortality and glory oh, of a new great boss, civilization. Oh, okay. Statue of marble and, and brass. I'm assuming that's dare challenge the majesty yeah, of the ancient ruler. Yeah, what you need to ruler. fight to get all oh, the Kinos mats. Yeah, that's right. The statue of marble and brass will soon be coming as a boss. You can earn all sorts of materials oh, if you manage to beat it. Oh, he starts out as a statue, but then yeah. <laughs> I'm so hyped. Decides for it. that you have to die. Yes. yes. And Damon, you did such a great yes, job with introducing it. That was great. <laughs> that was great, yeah. Damon. Wait, but real quick, quick question. Yeah. Is it How shooting music notes as attacks? Island? That is a great question. Travelers who have already completed hmm. the third act of the Archon Quest, Song of the Dragon and Freedom, oh. will automatically unlock a teleport waypoint in the village of Petra. Oh, that's, that's convenient. Hopefully this helps travelers with exploring the new area. I but wait, does it teleport right to the boss? Return for many new no, areas it just lets you go there. So exciting. I know. So cool. <laughs> All right. That's, that's all the information that's that we so good, have though. about <laughs> Just Fontaine so I don't have to swim now. my way over. And now, outside of the region, <laughs> dot, dot, dot. It seems like a new style of rock and roll is getting popular in Inazuma. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, not Inazuma, right, but wait, Shinyan? Let's all take a short break before we get into the next section. Take a look at today's second redemption code. Yeah. All right. Yeah, 4.6 looks stacked, not gonna lie. The Arlequino quest... A new area to fucking explore? Also, yeah, second redemptive code. Go ahead and uh, claim it. Otherwise, it expires in 12 hours. I will claim it myself shortly enough. But, uh, yeah, it's right there. Actually, I'll go ahead and key it in for you guys to, to see. The E-A-K-A. 5-B-U. Uh, 9-H-H-R-M. There you go. Copy and paste it into your redemptive code. And, yeah, claim it before it expires in, uh... 12 hours. I guess that's how long it takes. <laughs> really? Like, yeah, claim it quick. But yeah, this this update is like stacked so far. Like, yeah, the Alakina quest, and then also this new area to explore, and also a new weekly boss, and also Alakino herself. Jeez. Like. And now we're getting an Inazuma event with Shin Yan, presumably. Like, yeah, the Iridescence tour. Maybe that's happening now. <laughs> Maybe that's finally happening. Welcome back, everyone! Hey, that's why Ito's here! Okay. I hear that a musical tour is coming to Inazuma, and the organizer oh, you get a free is none as well. other that's, than Arataki well, Ito himself! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this Matt, guy's back! would you like to tell us more about it? It Wait, would be well, my absolute pleasure, Isn't this compadre? a guy who was so in... I got a question. Does everyone the still Lantern remember Rite? Dvorak? Mm -hmm. uh, of course! The Vorjack, he yeah, him. in last year's Lantern Rite, mm -hmm. right? That's oh, right. Yeah. Good, look at this art, though. Look at this art. That's Ooh. right. And this yeah, time, it's an epic tour Ear for the ages art, organized Rocky by none for other than Ito and Toward the Force of oh, Awesome. Oh my gosh, and even the content uh, name sounds really Where's Shin Yan, epic. though? Where's Shin oh, Yan? Yes. No, the way he says, She should be here for this. Arataki Rock and Roll Oh my god, the Force of Awesomeness really gives up the feeling of rock and roll. It's a little loud, that, And the theme of this concert is about Um, New Bullet Maid. Specifically, it's about a brave puppy who saved the lives of countless other creatures on the battlefield. No, <laughs> that's so also, cute. I see them fucking adorable. I'm really looking game. forward to it. <laughs> yeah, me Over too. Here. I really hope the Music Festival of Life will inspire everyone to unleash oh, their God, own and Hazel are here too? And spirit. Finally, and Hazel's making an appearance. You know, Where have you been? <laughs> Where's Hazel himself been? Himself will personally be performing Bro literally stage. has like the least amount of appearances, <gasps> I swear to God. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be awesome. <laughs> yes, it will be. And here's more exclusive news for you. Yeah. Dvorak will be giving away a brand new <gasps> musical instrument to our travelers the trumpet, called a fucking trombone? the Nightwind Horn. Ooh. So if you enjoy playing music in real life, or especially if you enjoy playing music in the game, be sure to check it out. I'm looking forward to How seeing more you have now, like from all the great musicians out there. The harp, oh, the you know. bongo. Well, since you're so excited about it, the, the fucking. Festival, why don't you help launch the? I, I could have sworn we have like one more. I forgot, honestly. <laughs> all right, there's three steps to preparing for the festival. Number one. Extreme Carnival Ensemble. Of course, they're gonna be playing the character the themes. With some rhythm games while the stage is still coming together. Uh, wow, I like that they're accustomed really to like whoever yeah, song they're playing. They really are. And the second task is called the Trillion Trinket Trawl. <laughs> See, that go kill fast. things. The Trillion Trinket Trawl. The oh, trillion no, trinket go collect trawl, things. Okay. Trawl. I did it. Ooh. We can't have <laughs> a rock and music festival without a rock and venue. So. Travelers will be helping Dvorak spruce it up with his list of items. It's a piece of cake, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And lastly, <laughs> we have the meeting of melodies. 
Can't have a party without adoring fans, so we got to invite fellow music lovers to come jam with us. Okay. After listening to their tunes, we can restore the missing music notes. Oh, oh okay. So we'll be able to hear them sing. That is super exciting. Yeah. Yes, that's the point. Music gets you pumped. And after we've rocked out to the pure spirit of music awesomeness in Inazuma <laughs> over Excuse in Mondstadt, we'll be dancing to a tense and thrilling tune. <gasps> Mondstadt? Are we going up. What do you mean Are by tense and thrilling? Does it mean anything if I say... Wind Trace, Seekers and oh, Strategy shit. has wind finally Trace is arrived. Back, baby. Ah, yes, I Holy shit. love Wind Trace, and and yeah, it can get a little tense at times. <laughs> well, that the new name implies that the game has undergone some mechanics changes. Yeah. Yeah, you're correct. That's very intuitive of you. Thank yeah, you. you'll be playing hide and seek as rebels. And yes, hunters, I love this game, but just honestly. Like before, but there are a few new rules. Uh, yeah, when rebels are captured for the first time, they'll be exiled to the surveillance zone for a short period of time. Oh, okay. Now, they will be automatically freed after their time out, but also their friends can try to help them escape the zone early. Oh, But if okay. you get sent to jail twice, you're permanently deleted from the game. <gasps> oh, that does sound tense and thrilling. <laughs> that sounds like, yeah, a lot better than, than oh, just no. getting caught at the round beginning. Will have six signaling devices, which will prevent nearby rebels from disguising or concealing themselves. The rebel's goal is to repair these devices while also avoiding capture. Once they repair oh, four okay. devices, they win the match. Four. Oh, and rebels can like work dead together by daylight. to repair oh, these devices. <laughs> and hunters will either need to prevent the rebels from repairing It's like, yeah, you captured your hooks, and then your teammates go on hook you. It's like dead by daylight, yeah. If you team up with friends, then edition. watching these games should be a blast. <laughs> ah, she gets it. She gets it. But the next part is even more thrilling. When rebels are fixing a signaling device, the device being repaired will enter the high-speed signaling state. What does it mean? It means it'll give off a light visible by every player in the area. In oh. fact, the device will even be marked on the minimap. Ooh, okay. So that means that repairing the devices will expose your location. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> it's these sort of unexpected risks that can be the most nerve-wracking. Mm -hmm. Holy this shit, look at it. Ain't they hauling plan. fucking yeah. ass? Oh, absolutely. And Jesus, that speed, event, though. Travelers will receive oh? a rather strange commission. Specially shaped Saurian search. Hmm. What I mean is, there's a chef who's famous for using unusual ingredients, and he wants to make friends with a pyro regisfine. Huh? Oh, yeah. What? And not just a pyro regisfine, he also wants to befriend a primo geovision. What? And a jade plume terror shroom. And what? the millennial pearl seahorse. What? <laughs> Excuse uh, me? <laughs> you guys heard me the first time. Yeah, I thought you would react this way. Anyway, a chef recently returned from a trip to Natlon. He's from Natlon. He started getting some ideas. He thought he should toughen oh, yeah, himself please. up by Natlan having Lord, his own when? companion. <laughs> you know, just like how people from Natlon have Saurian companions. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Kind of. Wait, did you say that he came back from Natlon? Listen, listen, Damon. If yeah. you want to oh, know the okay, details, okay. go check out the event <laughs> when the Virgin go is Go play light, the quest right? for the lore. But for now, go. it's time for me to introduce the okay, game. No, I, okay, no. Okay, all right. This seems like a comedy, right, but I'm not exactly you sure. Got it. You got In it. this challenge, you can adjust the difficulty and your negotiation strategies. If you've got oh. the guts, then you can take on fearless difficulty. Okay, it's so like just fighting the, the world bosses, but with like the number of negotiation strategies. <laughs> with a bit so more of a difficulty increase. Them, it amps up the challenge difficulty, giving you the perfect opportunity to test your skills. Cool. Gee, 16 Both minutes. Strategies okay. And long -term strategies we feel like available. we need to feed the flower now. Strategies at will. However, your opponent's HP and level will change depending on the number hey, of strategies. With Nuvolet, anything's possible. Oh. I'm, I'm very yeah. sure I can blast so through this Nuvolet. You've got to choose your favorite strategies to I'm come out just Top, saying. Your strengths. Wow. Noted. And moving on, travelers should oh, be familiar with wait. our next event. Oh, this again. Vibro Crystal Applications. Crystal applications. Ooh, it seems like the event involves connecting different vibrating crystals in order to generate different effects. Yeah, this event has been like run like five yeah, times already, right? So impressed by how Right, the zither, well. right. <laughs> That means that so much incredible. coming. <laughs> oh, yeah, we are like two yeah, liars well, as well for yeah, some reason. <laughs> each round requires two teams. Before each battle, you can set up Vibro Crystal Harmonics plans for each of your teams. Yeah, this seems this like the same as the other Vibro Crystal events. Combat buffs when you combine transmitter crystals and receiver crystals. It's a whale challenge. Basically, the transmitter crystal decides the trigger condition, while the receiver crystal determines the buff that your team gets. Oh, result. you talked about the previous By one, right? By connecting them in different combinations, you can create varying harmonics effects. 
It's your custom buff like it, plan. I feel like it's clear we'll even without about me to wail. And <laughs> but I guess we'll see. A harmonic point <laughs> well, I guess we'll see when the challenges do come out. Effect. You can get even more combat bonuses if you accumulate enough harmonic points. Each challenge will have different trial characters, so you can choose the harmonic buff that works best for your team setup. Nice. Be sure to maximize your points if you <laughs> want to Be sure to try a Wanderer, because we want you to pull nice. for him. <laughs> also, the Genius Invocation TCG event, oh, the shit. Forge Realms Temper, will be returning in version 4.6. Yes. The Heated Battle oh, Mode will and also receive an update, right. so don't miss out, I don't play TCG that often anymore, <laughs> and there's gonna be but an I still find the artwork of the cards so good. So you can more hey, double train talent books. I'm the already pre-farming for all the Kino, so I probably don't need this, but still. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you Good so much, Max. Else. You just did an amazing yes, job. That was impressive. Thank you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. uh, and thanks, guys. since you introduced so many events in one go, I feel like you deserve a little break. I you know what? Oh. I yes, you agree. I was gonna well, say I, I agree, agree too. I agree. <laughs> so how about now? Let's check out the the, the last, last redemption, redemption code. code. Yay! Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> All right. You look at this artwork though. We're fucking Ito fucking singing. <laughs> God, yeah, I cannot wait for this event. I, I'm excited for the Arlequina quest, but I'm but I'm also very very much excited for this. Oh yeah, I know some I know some artists on Twitter. I'm gonna are gonna go crazy over this. I know some people heavily ship <laughs> Hazel and Kuki. <laughs> but yeah, they they pretty much showed no, no story content regarding the Iridescent tour. So here's hoping Shinian doesn't get involved because you know that's a whole shtick. That's why she came to Inizuma in the first place. So hopefully she has an appearance of some sorts. <laughs> but god, this 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 update seems really, really stacked. I mean, no major art quests, but we do have like new explorable places, a new weekly boss, and some pretty fun events, not gonna lie. Like yeah, every single one of these events just seem interesting. I mean, Vibe Crystal we've done like a billion times, but still, I like playing that. Welcome back, oh. everyone! Oh, Next quality up, life stuff. we're nice. presenting some information about improvements for different in-game systems. Nice! Ooh, First ah. up, we have some updates for the Serena Teapot, such as the Quick Obtain feature. Instead of having to navigate a bunch of menus, oh, okay. you can use this feature to put all missing furnishings into a queue, where you can use one click to purchase any missing components and then craft your oh. desired piece. Wow. Ooh, that, okay, that seems handy. does actually sound very convenient. So convenient, <laughs> so convenient. But, you know, not not a lot of people do the furnishings updated, anymore. So you'll be able to use more portraits of your familiar <gasps> friends as your profile display. Oh, finally, more oh, fucking well, profile pictures than just the characters. Is Shirusato, isn't Ooh, it? that's cool. Oh, and there's, there's Arama, a jet and the Thunderbird. Fucking and profile Rue. picture? Oh, I'm gonna use that oh, for sure. And more? This is amazing. So <laughs> many more. I'm sure lots of travelers like them. Treasure compasses have also been updated. That's cool. Okay. Its <laughs> markers will be displayed like on both change. the large map and the mini map. The compasses oh, will thank also you. include information about I was having trouble with this lanes. today. Sweet. Oh, that's way more yeah. intuitive. Mm -hmm. It's time to eradicate. Uh, like, all I was the being confused at Chen Yu Bay where the chests were located progress. when I picked the compass. Hey, yeah! Exploration! Oh, yeah. Okay, in that case, I might hold off exploration until 4.6. I think I may just hold it off until it's then. It's time to talk about some Genshin Impact soundtrack news. <laughs> Let's go, music! Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Genshin Impact's Max third Melman. Fontaine OST, Cantus Aeternus, will debut during version 4.6. This album features original Still music Artifact created by stuff, the Hoyo though, but nah. for the new region of Fontaine I don't think they'll ever do it, to be honest. related content. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Music is my favorite! So hyped. <laughs> oh no, y'all! Uh, and that's the like end. There's nothing left for us to present. <gasps> Pretty oh, stuck to update, I not gonna lie. So I think that means. I probably should watch the, the trailer one more time when it does like come yeah. out of YouTube. So, is there anything but else? Overall, like, I think this update is ooh, ooh, absolutely stacked. Uh, what? Uh, we need to have Vin answer uh, right now in this moment? <laughs> um, it's okay, you've got now. this. Okay, got this. okay, uh, okay. I'll make go. it easy and just. Um, be very selfish and say that I'm just so incredibly excited for Arla Kino. Um, <laughs> I think did, everybody is. Everybody's excited for Arla Kino. Her. I think she's really cool, and I can't wait for everyone else to see how cool she is. Yay! She's so cool. Yay! She's so freaking cool, and I love 
the whole quest and everything secret that I can't talk about right now. <laughs> but I am also really excited for that and Linny's involvement in said things mm. and <laughs> in said uh, story quests and uh, yeah. yeah it yeah, seems so like it's gonna be a, a big anything, one. But I'm so so excited for you guys to experience this concert. It yeah. is. So good, and all I can say is that I had more fun recording for this uh, part of, of Genshin Impact than I've had in a long time recording. So, oh um, my god, that's be fun. amazing! <laughs> wow, I'm hey, any, e for all any of event of Ito too, is always I'm a good also event. Really though not me. For the Wind Race Festival, because I any love event so that involves <laughs> Ito at all and is automatically like good. A ton of awesome things coming in version 4.6. So I hope Seriously. everyone's excited. Yes, I am. Yeah. Yay! Wow, okay. I just have to say, this was so fun being here with you today. I'm so <laughs> glad I got to be here with <laughs> you guys. This, fun, guys. Like this is a good live stream. This is a very, so, very good one. Thanks for being here. And, and yeah, sign up, right? Sign up Act 2 program, Story Quest. Was so not expecting we that. We'll see you all in game. I'm yeah. very yeah. looking much forward to that one as well. Bye. Bye. See you later. Love you. Bye. <laughs> Bye. And yep, that's the end. Holy shit, that was a freaking lot. But yeah, what do you guys what do you guys think about that live stream? I think it was fucking really, really good from beginning to end. Let's recap, okay, real quick. Um Arlequino Act 2 Story not Act 2, my bad. <laughs> Sino Act 2 Story Quest. Arlequino Story Quest, Arlequino Weekly Boss. Uh the this uh events of the Ear Distance Tour, finally. Uh, what else? See, new artifacts, two new artifacts. Uh, we're, we're getting a brand new five star weapon, which is a scythe of, for Arlequino, which I think is really, really good. The banners are going to be Arlequino Lenny uh, rerun, and then second half is Wander rerun and Baiju rerun. Don't know why Baiju, even though he rerun recently, but okay. And, you know, yeah, all the other filler events that you just saw earlier. Man, this update this seems pretty, really stacked. Okay, real quick before I decide to wrap up everything uh, for today's stream, I want to go to, okay, the Genshin Impact YouTube channel. Wait, th th they're starting their own trailer. Okay, so, uh, oh, wait, no, th their one is done, I believe. Yeah, okay, so let's have a look at the, uh, like, yeah, let's have a look at the trailer it has once been more. Because I want to rewatch that. Like that. And the feeling is mutual. Because yeah, they said some all, stuff in the story that I that I'm intrigued about. Familiar faces in, 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 will in be the, uh, missing from the crowd the next time. Let's watch this one more time first. Well, something has come up, and since it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed it essential to inform you all. It was a great plan, shrouded in secrecy. We all gathered around and <laughs> yeah, celebrated at this the point revival of our like, what Lord. What's Sino doing That's in this? My power. The old man's been putting the pressure on me. He okay, so yeah, that that's child. The old man has been putting pressure on me. He sent someone to tell me I'm needed for some project. What is what old man? Um wait, the rooster? Um I forgot what its name is, but the little um short guy with the long nose, that that harbinger. Is this part of Arlequino's quest, I wonder? Sent someone hmm. to tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. Project Stuja? Participating in the plan. Project Stuja. A lot of members in the process. I did not anticipate we would meet again after presenting you with the Gnosis. Okay, that's Nouvellet, so he's definitely gonna make an appearance in this. If you accept my proposal, Monsieur Nouvellet, unless absolutely necessary, hmm. I will no longer carry out any special missions within the Fontaine. The uh, shit? <laughs> this fucking theme, though. Good lord. <laughs> It sounds so fucking dark, like her fucking soundtrack. Transfixed. Everlasting as yeah, the she, moon. She's fucking mewing with her fucking ultimate there. I see that. An order once given cannot be rescinded. Yeah, this NPC. What's the deal with this NPC? And why is he so detailed? No, this guy cannot be an NPC. He looks he looks way too good to be an NPC, you know? It's kind of like fucking, uh, what's her name? Uh, Chauvin, uh, in Star Rail. She, he looks way too good to be an NPC. Do you have any idea what you're doing? You're hiding the very person Father yeah, has been trying to find. this right here. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else into this. If Father finds- If Father finds out about this, yeah, everyone's gonna be involved. Everyone's gonna be punished. Which, probably, if I, uh, if I had to assume, leads to the ass beating that, uh, Arlequino gives the, the gang later about on. This. Everyone involved is going to be punished. A traitor. So who's Fremini hiding? I'm, that's what I'm really, really curious about. Sino was chosen, but he was not the only one. 
Oh. You'd like me to return my power? I'm really looking forward to this rite of duels. The wisdom of Hermanubis would have been ours. Oh, is that like Sinos rival or something? I want oh, yeah, and here you we go. to become the next king of the house. I want you to become the next king of the house. Yet yeah, you seem to have different ideals. That, that's gotta be addressed to Lenny. That's definitely and gotta be for Lenny. I can't think of anybody else. Seem to have different ideas. I'm not saying I have all the answers, but doing so will only bring us further away from being a real family. Aww. Your words paint an optimistic picture indeed. Allow me to remind you, Helen. You among us are willing to sip from a glass filled with tasty water. We are sure that drained of all impurities and returned to its cleanest form. Good things come to children who do as they're told. So I do hope you decide to tag along. There are many dangers ahead, and I, for one, don't intend to back down. Yeah, shit. I don't shit. want to disobey an order from Father. So why? Why have you backed us into a corner? No demonstration of loyalty shall go unrewarded. And no sacrifice shall be in vain. Yes, that, that's, that is very, very, that raises a lot of red flags. Like, already, like. So, I'm guessing Arlequina wants Linny to be, like, the next king of the House of Hearth. But, you know, he's refusing. <laughs> and Arlequina is, uh, you know, just a bit upset about it. Just a really a bit upset about it. Just, just, uh, just a hunch. That he's, a, She's, uh, you know, a tiny bit upset about the fact that Lenny won't take over. Oh boy, yeah, I... Who boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this really, really seems like Arlequino just, uh... Yes, unveiling her true colors, I think. I feel like the niceness that was shown throughout the entire Fontaine quest was just a facade. I mean, yeah, she wanted to save Fontaine, and Fontaine is saved. She's going to resume her mission as intended. And, oh boy, it seems like it's going to come to clashes with uh, our Fontaine trio here. But yeah, very, very much looking for that quest. It seems very, like, yeah, the most intriguing part about, uh, like, 4.6. And I absolutely cannot wait until it comes out. But... There we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is the end for us watching the 4.6 special program of Genshin Impact. Yeah, okay, I hope we do get, like, House of Hearth lore in this. I do hope we uh, see Child again in this quest. And I hope for, like, yeah, a lot of things regarding the Harbingers and whatnot. And, you know, Arlequino's goal and everything. But there you go, folks. That is the end of the 4.6 special program. What do you guys think? Let me know in, uh, in the comments down below. And also leave a like on the stream if you enjoyed my reaction to it. And also enjoyed the 4.6 special program as a whole. And also, you know, subscribe for more because I will be playing this update day one. Doing the story quest day one. And also pulling for Arlequino day one. <laughs> and also doing some Hawkeye Saria stuff on the sidelines as well. But yeah, guys, that is where I'm going to end things off for today, everybody. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know what are your thoughts again in the comments down below about the 4.6 update. And yeah, hope to see you all again in the next stream, which will probably be on Monday. But alrighty, folks, that'll be it for me for today, everybody. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys again in the next one. Y'all take care, and have a good night. And yeah, good luck with your Arlequino Linny, Wanderer, or Baiju pulls. And, or yeah, good luck with you guys pulling for the weapon as well. But alright, folks, that'll be it for me. See ya!